Welcome to another Goosebumps vlog. Did not think I'd be doing another one of these. It is 5.20 a.m. and I'm headed out for another few days in L.A. Goosebumps is available digitally on iTunes, Amazon, etc. So they're bringing Slappy in to promote that and the fact that the DVD will be out in a few weeks. Slappy's appearing at an awards banquet. I think I'm doing something with Rotten Tomatoes. Honestly, I'm not sure. <laughs> I got my plane tickets emailed to me 10 hours ago. So I'm very curious to see what comes out of this. This will probably be my last Goosebumps vlog. Does that mean I have to go back and change the name of the last one? Eh, nah, that sounds like work. So I get to make this journey one more time, and I'm taking you with me, so come on, let's go. No one should be awake when it's this dark. I have been driving for about an hour and a half. The sky is still pitch black. Time to get some gas, I'm gonna get some breakfast. And I think I got another 35, 40 minutes before I get to where I'm supposed to be. So happy to see the sunshine. I think I'm ready for this. It feels like an eternity since I've been here. It is also 7.30 in the morning, so my brain is not firing on all the cylinders it should be. I can't be too funny, so insert airport security humor here. Busy, busy day, very crowded at security. My gate is way on the other side of the airport. I got about half an hour till plane leaves, so yay. day for all of us. I did not miss those five hour flights. I zoned out and I thought I slept for a couple hours, but I only slept for like 30 minutes. And so I watched some comic book men and Paul Blart too. And not to down another Sony movie, but yeah, I probably should have taken a longer nap. So I'm trying to navigate this labyrinth back to where I'm supposed to be. It's a car waiting for me, taking me to my hotel so I can get some lunch before I gotta immediately launch into work. It's nice to feel important again. Jacket. I don't need it. This is California. I should have thought of that. It is 11:30 here, 2:30 at home. Just uh, got to the hotel. It is a gorgeous place. But I can't check in yet. My room's not ready. Just gotta sit around and be a bum for a while. I go in to do some work at Rotten Tomatoes at one. And then I believe that awards banquet is happening this evening. I really don't know. I'm just rolling with the punches. Hour and a half later, my room's still not ready. So I just went to grab some food at the food mart. And I go eat my junk food, get my sugar rush going. I get picked up in about 10 minutes. This place is open 24 hours. So I'm gonna be coming here a lot, I'm sure. <laughs> Very, very quick visit to Rotten Tomatoes repair scope. And now I am on the Sony lot trying to figure out where the heck I am supposed to be. Hey, look, it's where Peter Parker graduated from high school. One eternity later. Alright folks, I'm finally here, checked into the room. It is insanely nice. And they always leave a bottle of wine that I'm never gonna drink. They know my name. Still a nice sentiment, I suppose. Probably way too nice for a puppeteer, but I'm not gonna complain. Look, they appreciate my business. They left me a little bowl of checks, a little bowl of peanuts here, and a little bowl of gummy bears. Thank you. I really had no chance to film anything. We drove to the Publicist Guild Awards, where each major studio presented a film and a marketing campaign from the last year. So Slappy and Goosebumps were there, of course, along with, and this is where it gets insane, Star Wars The Force Awakens. 
Hopkins, as well as The Martian and Straight Outta Compton, and a bunch of other phenomenal movies. The thought of something that I had a hand in literally being mentioned in the same group as Star Wars is insane. But Goosebumps was there because it was a very unique and different online presence for a film. They've never had a character directly interacting with the audience, like we did with Twitter, and probably those of you who are watching this video right now. Fascinating to sit and listen to that stuff. It is 9.30 here, which means it's 12.30 at home, which means I've been running. Let's see, I got up at 5, so it's a long time. Long freaking time. I'm gonna get some sleep, because I got a little bit more to do tomorrow. I really don't know what's gonna happen. Yes, I do. I'm gonna sleep. I'll check in with you tomorrow. Until then. Peace. <laughs> Good morning, LA. Gosh, my bed head looks great. It is 12.30, which means it is 3.30 at home. <sighs> Still very tired. So long, normal sleep schedule I almost had for a week. Got a couple hours here. I get picked up at 3.45. Just ordered some lunch. Gonna try to kick a headache. Again, I don't know what I'm in for today. Shooting something with home entertainment, I believe, but I don't really know what that entails. But whatever it turns out to be, it'll be fine. Still trying to kick that headache. I just went back to Food Mart and got some ad. Because I didn't pack any. Because why would I? About 40 minutes till I get picked up. Just long enough to try to remedy that. <laughs> back now. That was incredibly fast. Went to a very spooky house and shot part of a uh, YouTube video for Twains. He was not there. I just shot the slappy side of things and they had someone else puppeteering slappy earlier, which makes me feel a little uneasy, but hopefully it'll cut together very nicely and no one will be able to tell, but I'll still be able to tell. And then turned around and drove right back. I was there for 25 minutes and it takes an hour plus to drive there so I spent more time in the car but everyone was super nice I'm super appreciative it was so fast I didn't even have time to take a slappy selfie like I normally do and I was determined to get a slappy selfie so I know it's not a very interesting vlog for those of you who wanted to see some candid slappy moments but I literally have had no time to do that I'm gonna order some dinner I'm up at seven o'clock in the morning for my flight back home it's been a lot of fun though a lot of little things they didn't have to bring me out for but for some reason they did so that's probably it for the night. I'll talk to you bright and early in the morning. Get some sleep. Good morning, day three. It is nearly 7.15. I am up, packed, dressed, kind of ready to go back home. Car will be here in about five minutes, so I'm gonna hop off, eat my Pop-Tart breakfast real quick, and there are no glasses in this room, so I'm gonna drink my milk out of this. Savannah's right, I am a nerd. is crazy. I should probably be used to that. On the way over, I learned that Alan Rickman has passed away. So that certainly didn't help the day start on a positive note, especially considering that I've only watched Harry Potter recently. I didn't grow up on that like most everyone else did. So I fell in love with those characters hard and fast. So that really stinks. This has been depressing. Let's head home. Just got redressed after security. Pretty quick, pretty painless. It's a Christmas miracle. incredibly packed here today. The plane is late getting in from his last flight, so we're on a bit of a delay here. So in the meantime, I'm gonna walk down somewhere. Yes, I bought a pop figure at the airport. Sue me. Back to more waiting, shall we? here in Atlanta about 45 minutes behind schedule. It was a mess. A lot of very unhappy people in a very tight space. Salted peanuts don't cure bad attitude. I watched Inside Out, Ant-Man, and Amy Schumer HBO special in an episode of Undateable. It's a long flight. Making my way over to Chick-fil-A now and then I'll head home and sleep because there was none of that on this flight. I have now eaten my chicken and waffle fries and I'm on my way to the parking lot. Such an exciting video. All this action, thrill, adventure. I'm gonna put a couple explosives in here just to spice things up. Did you see that? I've done this bit 120 times already, haven't I? At the car. Sweet, sweet car. And so far I've made it all the way across the country without squishing the box of my pop figure. I'm gonna blast some weird owl. Get the heck out of here. <laughs> 
And here we are. I am home. It is 9.30 at night. Travel has worn me down. I am exhausted. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed. And I will see you soon. Until next time. Peace. Aww.